fire alarm starts going off. You know, I thought it was a joke. It took just minutes. I just thought somebody pulled the alarm, so I took some toilet paper, shoved it in my ear, and sat there for a little while. For a confusing situation to turn deadly serious, it was around 5 p.m. when someone driving by a Comfort Inn along 114 called 911. When I see huge fire coming out of the top of the building. From inside. We walked around, the elevator was closed off. Renee Garza had already let a couple of minutes lapse. The third floor was just full of smoke and that's when we decided it was time to get out. By the time he made it down, he had to cover his face with the only clothes he managed to grab just to make it through the lobby. The stuff you see in the movies, it's real. I mean, it's that thick, you can barely see anything. Within two, three minutes, the whole building was in flames. You wouldn't believe it. Irving Fire is still investigating, but believes the fire began on the third floor where they rescued some and searched for others. Within a few minutes, it was upgraded to a four alarm fire, so it was advancing very, very quickly. Before collapse was imminent. Since the search was interrupted, we don't have any count right now. Of those who made it out, no injuries were reported. Just time and belongings lost and a bit of reckoning with what took place. It was just that perfect. You'd never imagine. In Irving, Allie Spilliards, NBC5.